These ones look cool. And, uh, it looks like uh, spaghetti or some sort of uh, lo mein. <laughs> that is nice. Weird contemporary guys. This one actually lights up. Some of them light up. They want to huck it against something. <laughs> It's a vintage uh, uh, tiki totem head. Stick. There you go. Kind of a cool jade color. We'll stick this guy aside and see if you get any other ones. Oh. <laughs> see if you get any others to kind of add to the goodness. Stack them up. I do have those in my store. If anybody would like to buy like a set of them, you kind of then you'll know you have them to stack together. Some little mutants. Oh, this looks cool in red. It's very cobra guy with a green eye. I like him in that color. The growing spider. Stick him in a jar. Watch him grow 600% of the size. Sounds good. Yep. Classic. Always classic. Hmm. I like these. It's like a weird um, toad, uh, rubber toad charm from Hong Kong. I have these in my store if anybody wants to get one. They're only a couple bucks. But uh, I got a bunch of vintage stuff in there. A little alien pencil jockey guy. Uh, you do get pencil form. Yeah. Stick them on the pencil for you. There you are. He's spacey little alien dude. It's a vintage um, Mad Ball bootleg kind of. Monster head pin. These are cool. These are, I just added them to the machine. These are like weird vintage smiley face like guys, but they're bootlegged onto like a troll body. So they got a little butt where the hair would go. They don't stand very well on their own, but you can prop them up against something. Pretty cool. Stay positive. These are just little tiny rubber dinosaurs. <laughs> I like the sculpt on this guy, he's funny. Oh good, you got another one of these stacking tiki totem heads. Different guy sticking his tongue out. We'll stack these guys together. Sometimes they get like little burrs of like material from the mold flashing. But if you take a little exacto blade, you can clean it up. So you can stack somebody on top there too. I don't want to force it, but clean it up ever so slightly. But they stack like this fine. I like that color comedy. Let's see, you got something on a ticket here. And you got a finger monster sticker. Let's grab one of those down for you. There we are. I think I have very few of these left in my store if somebody want, anybody wants to buy one. Some glowing red eyes. <laughs> they bounce too. Glowing, bouncing red eyes. Some little mutants. Some 
more little mutants. Different little guys, though. All right, last spin. Let's see what you got. You got one of these little um, baking powder submarines. I like this. You got all the primary color trifecta there. It's cool. Um, I it comes with these instructions. These are kind of bunk. <laughs> they uh, they tell you to use baking soda. You want to use baking powder. And then I have a highlight in the Monsters Booty Stories on my page. If you click on that highlight, it'll uh, it'll give you a little rundown on how to do these, um, or at least what I found works. Uh, there you go. It's a good one. I don't know. Those are fun. Stick them in the water with your spider. Thank you.